Last week, the US dollar got no love as improving economic data and positive coronavirus therapy news suppressed demand for the safe haven. On Friday, Trump said the U.S.-China relationship is severely damaged and that phase two trade deal is not a priority. Meanwhile, the U.S. coronavirus cases jumped on Sunday, hitting a record on Florida. But New York reported zero deaths for the day for the first time since March. Welcome to the Tickmill Update. I'm Kenna Daniel, the founder of the Invest Diva movement. Make sure to subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your forex trading friends. On Monday, we'll be looking at China's balance of trade and tuning into Fed's Williams speech. Today, I'm looking at the dollar yen pair, which is on its way to the 106.45 support level I identified last week, which also falls on the 50% Fibonacci retracement level. This level has prevented the pair from dropping since March, and if history is bound to repeat itself, we could see it turn into a challenge for the pair again. If the pair is unable to break below this level, we could be in a yet another bullish trade towards 107 and 109, respectively. Do you think the 50% Fibonacci retracement level will hold again? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading in the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates tomorrow.